supine from a supine's uh, point of view. I am a supine control, and you've heard Dr. Pennywood, my husband, talk about supines quite a bit and how he really enjoys working with them. And I also do too. Um, I think it's really important for the spouse of a supine to understand the supine as well as the person that has supine themselves. Um, growing up, I remember having to take on responsibilities and uh, make decisions. And so when I, re when I realized that I'm a supine in control, I was very surprised because um, I had been making decisions most of my life. Uh, when I was nine years old, uh, I went with my sister to uh, do a Bible school 100 miles away from my parents, and um, I led the singing, and, and I also taught the little class, the little kids' class. And so I was thinking about that once when I found out I'm a supine. I thought, wow, how did I ever do that? Well, obviously the Holy Spirit was there to help me and uh, to lead and guide me. So, you know, it's one of those things, though, that supines need to understand, that it will stress them out. And I realize, looking back now, that I probably was a little bit more stressed than what I realized, you know, being children sometimes, we don't always realize that. But now that I'm an adult, I can see that when I, if I have to make these decisions, I can do it only with the Holy Spirit's help. Now, it is important that you do have a spouse, or I always tell my supines, make sure you have a friend that, that you can call and, and talk to when you need to, to vent about certain things. Now, when I say venting, I mean someone that you can talk to them and tell them what's really on your mind. What What is it that made you angry. Uh, and remember, supines, when you think that you're um, hurt, it's really anger. And that's one thing I had to realize for myself, too, that I didn't have hurt feelings. It was really anger. And so uh, that doesn't, as a Christian, that doesn't always sound really good, but the fact is that that's the way it is. So I realized you know, as, as I began learning about the supine and learning how God wired me, uh, now supine is just one area in, in my, in my uh, control. I'm not supine in any other two, but it is in my control area, and that's, a, a, you know, that's where you control everything. So, anyway, it's really important for a supine to realize it is okay to be angry, okay? as long as you realize that it's not hurt feelings, it is anger, and then you vent it to your spouse or to a good friend. It's important to do that. We want to make sure that supines understand it's okay to vent. Um, I was working with a, a man that is a supine, and he did not want to vent to his spouse. and had to let him understand that he really needed to because what they would do is keep it on the inside and then they would explode. So it's important that they understand that you vent. Venting is so very